Hi everyone, it is me again, Mini Mshongo, and today we are talking about feeding. So, there are two types of ways to feed your baby, and that is breastfeeding or formula slash bottle feeding. So, not everyone can breastfeed, um, and this is determined by obviously the production of your milk. Some people do not have enough milk to breastfeed and therefore they have to resort to bottle feeding so breastfeeding is so much better than bottle feeding in so many ways so the advantages of breastfeeding is that your baby gets all the nutrients in the right proportions and brain development is optimal and then also the suckling helps the development of the jaws and your baby is less likely to become obese it's also just economical because you don't spend any money and it's on tap you just chuck your boob out give that baby some milk and also um, one of the advantages is that um, you lose weight that's if you eat in moderation of course you can't just eat everything and anything and expect to to you going to lose weight and then the disadvantages would be that your partner can't feed the baby so that they don't bond with the baby because it's a disadvantage for your your partner but your partner can help in other ways like winding the baby changing the baby's diapers and stuff and also it's just an advantage that you don't have to wake up at night and go mixing formula <laughs> give your baby um cold milk you can't make the the formula before you sleep and put it next to your bed so when the baby is hungry you take it and feed the baby that is wrong because by then it's going to be cold and also you can't put it in the microwave okay, so with formula so feeding yo know, there are many types of formulas that you can use but it is best to to talk to your pediatrician or your midwife or your nurse um they can advise you as to which formula to use um, I did ask a few people about formula um, that they used and the ones that they mentioned were S26 Gold Nan and InfraCare so with my baby what happened was when I was still in hospital because the first few days you don't have milk you have colostrum that's the first milk so you 5 ml is equal to 30 ml with colostrum and so i had to top up after every feed and the the formula that they used for me was um nan and f it was good for my baby like she never reacted badly to it so if i had to stop bre breastfeeding now and was forced to formula feed i think i'd use nan because of those reasons because it treated her well she didn't have um, any problems she didn't have a runny tummy and all those things and sometimes people breastfeed and formula feed at the same time four weeks old um formula feeding plus breastfeeding the reason for the formula is because my milk was not enough for the baby so they said that i must top up so when I came out of hospital, my friend recommended that I try the OptiPro, the NAN, and it actually working for me because I'm doing both right now. So I will breastfeed her and then I'll top up with the, with the NAN formula. Sometimes people don't choose to, to bottle feed. They have to bottle feed because their babies are lactose intolerant meaning that they can't take in dairy or dairy products so i know this because my sister's baby was lactose intolerant and she had to bottle feed her baby and you don't use normal formula when your baby is lactose intolerant you need to use a special formula i know she used isomil which is for babies that are lactose intolerant and luckily the baby outgrew um outgrew it so yeah and then another thing is colic. Colic is not only for bottle-fed babies, but a breastfed baby can also have colic. 
and colic is usually because the baby is not latching onto your areola properly or the bottle properly so you need to make sure that the baby's mouth is like around here so this is like your nipple these are the bottles that are shaped like the mother's boob so it is round here so you need to make sure that your baby's mouth is like fully on latched and then these are the bottles that are not like your, your boob as you can see so these are the old-fashioned ones remember I did say that companies are now making bottles that are shaped like the mother's boob which are like these so yeah and that is also why I don't um, use a pacifier because the baby takes in the air and then it has a so power. I think we can all agree that breastfeeding is the best option for you and your baby for many reasons hi everyone my name is Linka Fabulous I'm a performing artist and a radio host but my most important job is to be a mother I am a mother of two beautiful kids one is a boy one is a girl my eldest is seven years old and my youngest is a year old um, the reason why I've decided to breastfeed is because is simply because obviously the nurses do say that it is very healthy and it helps with the growth of the baby and it's the healthiest way to go so yeah that's why I chose breast milk and also it helps to just connect with your baby so yeah and it's really up to you as to how long you want to breastfeed your baby i know with me i just want to push for at least a year sometimes your breast will just stop producing milk and you can't do anything about it so you will be forced to go to f formula so yeah anyway from me my name is Longo. i will catch you again the next time make sure you subscribe and you give this video a thumbs up and feel free to ask any questions so adios